Welcome back to Lamp Vision Studios. It is great to see you back. Today we're going to be talking a little bit about UEFN, which is Unreal Engine for Fortnite, and a little bit about Unreal Engine and migrating those assets from Unreal Engine to UEFN. I had a buddy of mine have this biome here, and he really liked this demo level and how it looked. So he was asking me how he could import that from UE5 to UEFN. And for some reason, it was giving him an error or he wasn't able to launch the session. Well, today I'm going to show you guys a quick workaround. I mean, I guess it's quick. It's going to take a little while uh, just to show you guys. But as you can see, I'm just taking that asset folder and migrating those assets over to Unreal Engine. Now, I'm going to show you this process again here in just a second because you're actually going to do two different things if you're trying to import a level straight from there to UEFN. So as you can see, these packages are kind of just saving to the destination. And I apologize in advance for the video being kind of cut off here to the left. Uh, something just got cut off for some reason. But you're just going to click on your demo level here in Unreal Engine 5. And you're just going to go to Asset Actions and Migrate. And migrate that into your content folder of your UEFN project. Now, notice I actually did the folder that it was located in, the entire folder with all the assets, and I also migrated just the demo level itself. Now, the reason I did this is just to make sure that both the assets from the file folder and the assets from the demo level are all together for this project. And once you're back inside of UEFN, you're going to have that folder that you migrated over inside your content browser for your UEFN project. And I'm just going to the map demo here. You can see that file there. It's actually a little bit cut off, guys, and I apologize for that. But that is the demo level scene, and I'm clicking on that demo scene uh, just to see what that demo looks like inside of UEFN. So now that I have that opened up, you can see the biome, and it looks pretty cool. So again, I'm just opening the demo scene inside of UEFN. So what I'm going to do is actually select all the assets in this scene, and I'm going to hit Copy, or Control-C. And I'm just going to go back into my main level that you started on in this blank project. Or you might be able to do this in any project for that matter. But I'm just doing it in a blank project just to show you guys. So I'm actually hitting paste here. But it's taking a long while to import the actors. Now you can see it's starting to import all those actors. I think it was like 11,000 or something. Which is quite crazy. But... We're going to go ahead and import those actors by copying and pasting it from the demo scene to your Unreal Engine old blank scene. Or your new blank scene, my bad. All right, so you can see it pasted everything into my new level for UEFN. So you have all your assets here that were supposed to be copied and pasted from that demo level. So again, I just copied and pasted from the demo level that was already in UEFN, not the Unreal Engine file. So we're going to go ahead and launch the session here and just see what it does. And this might take a while, just depends on how many assets you have. All right, once it's done doing that, you're just going to click on the blue here. If you get this pop-up notification, make sure you click on the blue. I can't remember what it says, to be honest. I think it just says make assets private or something like that. So click on that. Don't click cancel. Again, don't click cancel. Okay, then it might ask you to save these assets. Now, if your game crashes, 
it's totally okay. Just reopen it. Just hit okay on everything. And you might get some errors or something. You might get a crash. It's totally okay, guys. Just go back and reopen your project. Make sure that everything was saved. It should have already been saved from the save there. But then now we're going to go into our content browser. We're actually going to delete that demo level and the demo level, I believe it's assets there. So those two files out of that content folder, make sure you delete the demo level, also the demo level data file there as well. So now I'm getting this validation error. So in my errors here, it's actually telling me what's causing the error. So I'm just going to click on that and it automatically takes me to this actor that may be causing a problem. So I'm just going to delete that actor out of the scene. We don't want it. We're going to go ahead and try to launch the session again. And now it seems to be uploading it to Unreal. And, oh, there we go. We have Fortnite coming up. So now basically we just need to see if we'll load in the game. So it might take you to this menu here, depending on how many assets you have. It might be a lot to load. So it could take a long time. So what I'm seeing is this downloading here in edit mode actually might be stuck at zero for a long time. But it will go through, guys. It should go through. And it will load your project. And you're about to see here it actually load the project. All right, guys, it looks like we loaded into our biome here and it's a nice little swamp and it looks like the collision is already ready to go for this biome, which is awesome. So now he'll be able to use this biome inside of his project. So anyways, if you guys like this tutorial, if it helped you guys out, let me know in the comments. Also, if you have any questions about maybe something you missed. Go ahead and leave that in the comments as well, and I'll try to help you the best I can. I appreciate you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.